Good morning, South Amboy Elementary School. Another edition of Mindful Mondays with Mrs. Masella. So let's start off as we always do with our three deep breaths. It's a good way to get started. And remember, we're going to breathe in through our nose like we're smelling the flowers, and we're going to breathe out through our mouth like we're blowing out the birthday candles. And three is the best number to help us relax. Ready? Let's do it together. Remember, Mrs. Masella closes her eyes. So I'm doing something a little bit different this week because this week is Thanksgiving. We have um, Thursday and Friday off. And something special that Mrs. Masella does at her Thanksgiving dinner is we talk about things that we are thankful for. And I know many of us will be celebrating Thanksgiving um, this year. And it might look a lot different than it has in the past because of everything going on and that we need to stay safe but it's still important to take that time and be mindful about all of the good things that we do have, even though bad things have been happening and maybe somebody in your family has gotten sick or moms and dads are stressed out and teachers are stressed out and you guys might be stressed out too, but there's still lots of things we can think about to be thankful for. So I'll do it like I do at my Thanksgiving dinner and I will tell you that I am thankful for my mom. Yep, even though Mrs. Masella is a grown-up lady, she still needs her mom, and my mom is always there for me, whether it be to listen to me when I'm feeling upset about something, to making me a delicious food because she's a good cook, or to spend time with baby Ian sometimes if I need to get other chores done or take a little break. So my mom is always, always there for me, and I'm very, very thankful for that. So that's actually what I would like you to focus on this week, which is to think about the people in your life that you're thankful for. And it doesn't have to be somebody who even lives in your house with you. It could be somebody else. My mom doesn't live in my house with me anymore because I'm a grown-up, but she is one of the people that I am most thankful for in this world. So that's what I want you focusing in on this week is the people that you're thankful for. And instead of our positive message being about ourselves, we're going to focus on I am thankful for blank because blank. So if you're doing this each day and thinking about those positive messages each day, each day I'd like you to think of someone that you're thankful for and give a reason why, just like I gave you the reasons of why I'm thankful for my mom. So that's what I want you focusing in on this week. It's a short week. I hope that you have a wonderful Thanksgiving if you do celebrate Thanksgiving. If not, then just enjoy those extra days off. Make sure that you relax do something fun with your family or your friends, and I will see you next Monday. Bye, friends.